Hello everyone, this is Logan at fpweb.net. Today I'm going to be taking you through a tour of our ticketing template. Um, this is going to be a look through the, uh, the administrative view um, of this template. Uh, typically as a user you'd only have access to the uh, creating a ticket screen that you see right here. Um, so as you can see I'm putting in some information on a ticket, um, just some you know information to help them troubleshoot whatever the issue might be. Um, you can also fill in fields for who it was submitted by, some contact information, and things like that. Okay, so at this point the ticket has been created. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and look at the admin side of the tickets. You can now see it under the open tickets uh, drop down there. Um, there's a drop down for each separate status that a ticket could be in. Um, here you can review the information, look at the contact info, stuff like that. Now, of course, rather than just viewing these tickets, you can also go into them and put whatever response that you would like to on the ticket. Um, you can then update the status on the ticket, say if you know it's in progress, being worked on, maybe it's being sent to billing, uh, maybe it's completed, maybe it's been completed for a long time and it's in the archives. Um, so you can set whatever status that you would like on those tickets. You can put whatever you would like in the comments for those. It's completely up to you and completely customizable. And as you can see here, I had forgotten to move that ticket over to closed, so I went ahead and went back into that ticket, moved it over to closed, and now it appears under that drop-down. So, um, now that we've taken a look at the ticketing system and how that works, let's take a look at the other features on the site. Um, so we also have included a document library. Um, just go ahead and open this document here. It just shows you know some text that I made, um, nothing major. So that's it for the document library. Um, let's move on to something else. Uh, here we have the support calendar. This will list out all the events that you have um, set up in the home page. You can add events. Um, they'll appear on that calendar. We also have built in a FAQ system where you can put whatever questions that you may commonly receive about your site, about your company, and then you can put in common responses to them or, or the correct answers so that you don't get bombarded with tons of tickets that are easily resolved. Um, we also have a tech links page built in with links to maybe helpful sites for your administrative users to be able to troubleshoot or resources for them. Um, that's all for this video. Um, thanks for watching.